Oh, oh, that felt so good. So, are you like a like a a pro bowler or I'm like not a pro bowler? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> But no. I mean, that's pretty cool. Like you travel yeah. for the bowling league. Yeah, just to Vegas every twice a year. And then you guys just like party after? Yes. A lot. Oh, wow. Do you like drink when you bowl? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Do the pros like not? Uh, no, I don't think so. Yeah. I feel like it would be easier for me. I need to have like a little, little bit of the edge off. Yeah. There's like a point where either I'll bowl really well drinking or not. Yeah, and then you just drink more, and then you just... <laughs> and then you suck. Yeah. Or you're really good. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yep. And you live for those moments. <laughs> so she, she mentioned she has a little bit of the clicking in the front of the hip here. Mm -hmm. Usually it's a sign of instability in the right low back SI joint, and a little bit of um, a strength issue in the right hip flexor. So instead of stretching it, we would strengthen it. It's new school. New school science i always start in the front of the neck because everybody breathes with their chest mm -hmm. and it gets the front of their neck super tight and it's just you know it's it's not good for you what do you like to do for fun do you bowl like all the time oh, no i do not oh, once a okay. week okay okay but i like to go to disneyland oh okay and we like to drink <laughs> oh what do you like to drink oh i just drink tequila oh same <laughs> I was just having this conversation with someone else. What kind of tequila do you like? It just has, it has to be good tequila. <laughs> but like if it's just like a, a regular, normal tequila, it would be Casamigos. Okay. Yeah, you know? I like the Casamigos Reposado. Yeah, yeah. That's my favorite. I like all of it. But like if I want to like get a nice bottle, I'll go to Costco and just, I never know what it's called, but I'll get like the most expensive one, you know? <laughs> and I'll bring it to my friend's things and I'll be like, yeah, this was like 80 bucks. It should be good, right? <laughs> so I'm gonna get in your hip flexor a little bit. Okay. But actually first, we're gonna work on this chain here going up. Oh, anterior tibialis. Find the, the tibia, the shin bone. Go a little bit lateral. And we'll just kind of make sure there's no areas of fascia that are just stuck. Oh, that was nice. Working on the IT band. So when we kind of block the IT band like this and then externally rotate at the tibia, it increases internal rotation at the hip for all the nerds out there. Okay, bend, get it right in here. It might be a little ticklish. <laughs> it's okay, it's for science. I'll just make it hurt like a lot more. <laughs> bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. Good. Oh. All the way down. Straighten it, straighten it. Perfect. All the way up. So this is really tight. Sometimes it's tight because it's weak. It has a big job to do. And if it's not strong enough, it'll just kind of crawl into a ball and hope for the best. That's usually what happens. Okay, now I want you to do it yourself. Just straighten your leg out. Perfect, and back up. Nice, and down. Good. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, that was like a weird feeling. Yeah, it's gnarly. That's what we say in California. <laughs> gnarly. gnarly. Oh, what the heck? That wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, right in the freaking neck. Wow. You don't, you don't tension. get any headaches? Um, I used to a lot before, but not much now. Honestly, it's just probably a lot of stress and no sleep. Why no <laughs> sleep? I work a lot. I work like 55 hours. What? Okay, let's talk about this. Why? <laughs> I'm a restaurant manager. I love my job. It's just a lot of hours. Yeah. What restaurant? Uh, King's Fish House. And then our sister company is like Water Grill or... Oh, what? Mm -hmm. I know Water Grill. Yeah, or Meat on Ocean. Wait. Now you're going to have Kings, to visit me. King's Fish? Oh, Oh, that felt so good. King's Crack? Fish? <laughs> King's Crack? That wasn't funny? <laughs> no. Oh, good. God. Doing great. Good job. We're going to try to pull this leg at an angle here. Just kind of let it fall. Mm. Now let's do the other side too. Let it fall. Perfect. Lift your feet up and down. Okay, so right glute's probably gonna be a little tight too. Let's get in there a little bit, shall we? Yeah, right in there. Pretty tight in this right, actually both erectors. Tickle? Mm -hmm. So that is actually a sign of her body trying to protect this area. 
that does mean that there's something going on. So I have to try not to tickle her as much as I can. So if she lets me in, stop putting up so much barriers, you know? Oh. Good. We're gonna do one more, okay? Just try to relax that chest. I need to hit it up. Perfect. Very nice. A little bit in the sacrum here. Good. Well, let's feel around, see what's going on. So I'm gonna do a left sacrum here. And honestly, maybe a flexion on the ish tube on the, on the right. Lay on your right side. Okay, so we're gonna go right on the sacrum. This is your first time doing this, huh? Yes. Wow, you're acting like a natural. Mm -hmm. So I gotta go up and into it like that. Oh, that was so good. That was good, that was really good. Okay, so we're gonna try to do a flexion on the ish tube here. Beautiful, nice, let yeah. it fall. Good job. Wow. Okay, here, come on up. So I wanna show you like a way that you can strengthen your hip flexor. This is for, for everyone. Say hi to Santa. <laughs> so you need to get on like a uneven thing mm -hmm. and then just bring it up. Get, get a weight on your foot, bring it up. Strengthen the hip flexors, not just stretch it out, but you can also stretch it if you want. Usually, if you feel like that clicking all the time, it means something's just too loose. Something's like not nice and tight. Strengthening it can help a lot, okay? okay. And like yeah. if something's too loose, why would you stretch it? You know, it doesn't mm -hmm. make sense. Yeah. But like that's that's the world we've been living in for the last like 20, 30 years. Everyone thinks that you need to stretch your hip flexors. But yeah, okay. we're, mov we're moving so away from that. Good. Definitely do this as like a warm up. Okay. And then go into the cycling class or something. Okay. Have a seat here, legs hanging off. So I'm gonna do that Y strap thing on you now, okay? Okay. Have you seen it? Yeah, I have. Thoughts? Scary. Oh, <laughs> we love to hear it. Okay, so I'm gonna put this around your head. Okay. Stretch you out a little bit. Make sure it feels good. Make sure all this is relaxed. Yes, there it is. Wow. Lift your head up. Good, not on the ears. Perfect. So first off, is this okay on your cheeks? Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. She thinks so, okay. <laughs> Let me know when it starts to feel good. It should feel kind of like, oh, that feels nice. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Okay, good. So I'm just gonna pull a little bit harder. Let me know when you can feel it down into your low back. Oh, God. Ooh. Nice. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> that was clean though. Did you feel it? It was like, yeah. it was like, <laughs> bend, bend. Nice, big, deep breaths, okay? Slow it down, slow it down. Really feel it go in, feel it go out. But yeah, overall, feels pretty good. That was good. Yeah. I felt really good. Yeah, I mean, oh, I that think- last one was crazy. I think there's more stuff going on in your neck uh -huh. than you think. Okay. So just keep that in mind. Okay. You know, a lot of the stress from managing a restaurant, <laughs> 55 hours a week, yeah. listening to everyone's complaints, mm -hmm. making sure people do their jobs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a lot. It's and really fun. sometimes our bodies are really good at like, hiding it, mm -hmm. and then it comes out hard one day. Yep. And uh, yeah, it takes a little bit longer to get rid of it then. So I'm glad you came. No, me Good too. Good job. Yeah. Thank you. High five.